G'day everyone, I hope you're doing great. This lesson is for Back Against the Wall by Cage the Elephant. To kick things off, we are super simple and super mellow, just over on the right cymbal with a kick on beat one. Then we are just going to add rim clicks on beat 2 and beat 4 and one extra kick drum every now and again. At the end of that verse bit there is a tiny little fill that is really easy. That feel takes us into the pre-chorus, which is kind of the most interesting groove in the whole song, just because we bring that second snare drum away from the backbeat onto the end of three, and we're gonna add a sizzled hi-hat on the end of four as well. So together, it sounds like this. At the end of that first pre-chorus, we have another nice, easy feel going back into the verse. So that takes us back over to the ride cymbal, playing through the verse again, using the same feel to get us into the pre-chorus again. But then at the end of the pre-chorus this time, we have a build-up and a different feel, which is going to take us into the chorus. Now for the chorus, we're going to open up the hi-hats a little bit and play this rock beat, which again is pretty straightforward, so I think you'll get this down in no time. Once again, there's a nice basic fill at the end of that section, taking us into the verse. So this is what that will sound like. Now we're up to verse 3, which is just the same as the other two verses. Then we move into the pre-chorus once again, and then onto the chorus using just the same fills. And then we're into the bridge, where we're going to play floor drum and snare drum, and the kick drums, playing eighth notes building up for the entire section. There's a little fill in between, but I'll play the whole thing for you now. So the first fill halfway through is just sixteenths on the snare drum, nice and easy. And then the one at the end is just the same as the one that we've been using getting into the chorus. So that's pretty easy as well. It's just a matter of finding when to come off from the floor toms and snare drum and straight into that fill. But with a bit of practice, you'll nail it. Then we're into the guitar solo and we're actually gonna use this kind of beat for the whole rest of the song. So we've got the guitar solo and then the outro, but basically the drums are playing pretty much the same thing. So let me play through that for you now.
So the only trick there is that we're adding some crash symbols onto the snare drum on beat four and adding a couple of extra snares as well. If you haven't done it before, it might be a tiny bit tricky, but I think you'll probably work it out in about five minutes and then you'll be able to nail this end section too easy. I'll play the very last couple of bars for you and then we're done with the song. And there we go, those are all the beats and all the fills that you'll need to play Back Against the Wall by Cage the Elephant. It's pretty straightforward, it's a nice rocking song, so hopefully you get it up and running in no time. Have fun with it guys, and I'll catch you at the next lesson.